Nigerians react as terrorists attack presidential guards. Hey guys, this is VOS TV. If you're new, kindly subscribe and hit the notification button for more trendings. Barely 24 hours after terrorists threatened to abduct President Muhammad Buhari and Nasser El Rafai, the governor of Kaduna State, in a viral video, troops of the guards' brigade have been ambushed by terrorists in Abuja while on a routine patrol along Kubwa, Bari Road, by suspected terrorists. According to military sources, the terrorists have laid siege to the federal capital territory, FCT, with the intention to attack the law school in Bwari and other government facilities. We call that the Nigerian Army Guards Brigade provides security for the presidential villa, the nation's federal capital, Abuja, and neighboring communities. And this ambush took place at Bwari, which is just 42 kilometers from Aso Rock Villa. Where President Muhammad Buhari lives. The presidential spokesman told us that the president has done all that is expected of him to halt the drift. The assistant director, Army Public Relations Guard Brigade, Captain Goffrey Akaba, confirmed that among the troops of 7th Guard Battalion on a routine patrol, few were wounded in action and have been taken to the hospital and are receiving treatment. At the moment, our troops are still on the lookout for the criminals that have been threatening the general area. He urges the residents to go about their daily businesses and should keep cooperating with the armed force by giving useful and timely information to enable them win this fight against a group of criminals performing this heinous acts. These are some of the reactions on Twitter about the ambush that took place yesterday. Shehu Ghazi Sadiq If care isn't taken, terrorists will soon be in Lagos, terrorizing the business community. Lagos is the business and financial hub of Nigeria. If terrorism engulfs Lagos, Nigeria is finished. We become Somalia and Afghanistan. May God forbid bad thing. This other person says terrorists milking rocking in Abuja. Parents taking their kids from school for fear of kidnap and my man's getting ready to deliver a speech on security in another country. The clouds you see over Nigeria, you know the rest. The president of Nigeria has failed us and he should resign. A military captain was killed yesterday in Abuja by terrorists, the president's security team. This showed that these terrorists are getting closer and closer to sit. They are closing in on the FCT. Lastly, Ekunda Yolatune, terrorists attack on presidential guards 24 hours after threat of President Buhari kidnap, an indication that sovereignty of Nigerian state is under serious threat. I beg drop your comment for the comment section. We will know what you think for this matter.